Hi and welcome. You're here with Bella Katrina. Going to do a message for um, prosperity prayer. Wanted to tell you also to buy a Bible. They're going to be banned along with confiscation of guns in America. Started already in little towns. Powerful prayer now to break financial curse or money curse. So if you've received the Holy Spirit, you need to say this out loud after me or let it wash over you or say it inside your mind and leave it on loop constantly until something changes. We're doing things until here with me. In the name of my Lord Jesus Christ, I bind and cast out all unclean spirits that were sent my way with the purpose of hindering my prosperity from flowing freely into my hands. Get out of me now, evil spirits, poverty spirits, demonic mindset, and poverty mindset demons. Get out of me now. Any word cursing, generational poverty strongholds, pride, greed, lust for money, uncontrollable spending and debt, out of and away from me now in Jesus' name. In the name of Lord Jesus Christ, I bind and cast out all evil spirits sent out to distract, blind and hinder everyone out there that are supposed to give me monetary gifts and financial blessings from fulfilling their God-ordered assignments. In the name of Jesus Christ, my Lord, I break all assignments. of the devil that were keeping them from giving me monetary blessings. Get out of them now, unclean spirits, and go to the abyss in Jesus' name. In the name of my Lord Jesus Christ, I bind and cast out all unclean spirits sent out to block any monetary ideas from getting to me. I bind and cast out all evil spirits sent out to block monetary ideas from getting to me. I bind and cast out all evil spirits sent out to block monetary ideas from getting to me. I bind and cast out all evil spirits sent out to block God-given opportunities of success and fulfillment assigned to me by my Creator. In the name of my Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth, get out of me now, unclean spirits. Get away from me. Get out of my life. I bind and cast out all kinds of evil spirits, demonic forces and evil powers that have been fogging my mind blinding my understanding concerning the truth of God's word in the matter of giving and sowing joyfully into the kingdom of God and into the life of others. As it is written in Luke 6.38, Give and it shall be given to you. Good measure, pressed down, shaken together and running over, shall man put on to your bosom. For with the measure that you measure, it will be measured back to you. In the name of my Lord Jesus Christ, I bind and cast out all evil spirits, demonic forces and evil powers that have kept me blinded from the reality of giving. Out of me now, evil spirits, demonic forces and evil powers, any of you that have kept me blinded from the reality of giving. Out of me now, unclean spirits, demonic forces and evil powers, and go to the abyss in Jesus' name. I am a giver through my Lord Jesus Christ, now in the name of Lord Jesus Christ, and the powers vested in us. We loosen the holds of the devil and his forces, whatever they may, may be, upon our supply, from those who are holding on to them. Father God, your word teaches. Your word teaches us that we cast down every evil imagination, bringing into captivity every contrary thought of disobedience to the distribution of God's supply to meet the needs of the saints. Therefore, we cast down every high thing that exalts itself against the knowledge of you. In the tithe plan, we lose these funds, we release our supply and direct it to be forthcoming to us so that our work and our life may go on unhampered. Father God, please send your holy angels to go forth according to Hebrews 1.14 and to bring in these finances. In the name of my Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I break every spirit of poverty that was inherited through my bloodline. We wipe it off my life by the blood of my Jesus. I bind all family curses of poverty and break every satanic chain of poverty over my life and off it in the name of Jesus Christ. Father God, please break me out of this financial cage I have been trapped in for many years. I need your blessings of prosperity in my life. 
I am tired of financial problems I have been having. Please, Father God, release me and bless me, and in turn I can be a blessing to others. Please come to my aid, Heavenly Father. You are able to all grace, favour and earthly blessings come to us in abundance. We realise that you are now working on this presented matter and we await with thankful hearts to receive from you. I pray all of this in the mighty name of God and in our Saviour Jesus Christ. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit, we ask for your grace, your guidance. Thank you God for your healing, your salvation and your deliverance through your Son Jesus Christ and the power of the Holy Spirit. Fill us full strength with this power and help us not get distracted in any way. Help us focus on you and be the light that you sent us to be. Thank you, Father God. We now open to receive your blessings in your Son's name, Jesus Christ. Thank you, thank you. This is what I wish for all of you. Please play this constantly, daily, until something happens. I love you, but Jesus loves you more. Buy a Bible and read the Bible. We've got scriptures coming up. I love you. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.